As many people know, in SAP Business One HANA, we can have multiple analytics and dashboards. What I want to show you today is a brief overview of attaching analytics to certain forms within SAP Business One. What we're looking at is SAP Business One for HANA. This happens to be version 9.1. Let's just go into the Business Partner Master Data. And what I can see on the right hand side is UDFs and Analytics. Let's click on the Analytics. Now what I can see is I have the ability to have within SAP Business One for HANA analytics attached to the Business Partner Master Data. I can see it in graphical format or grid format. Now let's show you quickly how we might set this up. So let's go into Pervasive Analytics. Now for those of us familiar with SAP Business One HANA Pervasive Analytics, I have a number of KPIs and dashboards, or I can create my own new KPIs or new dashboards. For the sake of this demonstration, let's take an existing dashboard. So let's look at, uh, let's take gross sales, shall we, by year. Now what we want to do is take this existing dashboard and we want to add it to the sidebar on the Business Partner Master Data form. So in front of us, we can see the sales by year from 2006 to 2015. To add this to the sidebar on the business partner form, let's click on the action button. Now I can see that SAP Business One says display dashboard in sidebars. Let's click on that option. Let's open up the target SAP Business One window, which in this case is going to be the business partner master data. But we can also see that we can attach analytics to multiple other windows. The AR invoice, the sales order, the delivery, the AP invoice, the item master, and some others. So let's choose the business partner master data form. Let's go out of there. Let's save that within analytics and we'll give it a name. Gross sales by year, BP for business partner. And now let's go back into that same business partner, Earthshaker Corporation. Let's click on the Analytics tab. And I can now see the gross sales by year. As demonstrated earlier, I can see this in graphical format or in grid format. Let's have another example of that. Let's go into an item master inventory. Item master. Let's call up a particular item. Let's get the item code correct. Okay, and again, analytics. In this instance, I'm looking at my stock turnover for the last 12 months. So what we've seen there is a couple of very simple examples, but very useful where we can have analytics and multiple analytics tabs, by the way, attached to item masters, business partner masters, and other windows in SAP Business One. And we also saw how easy it is to go in and take an existing dashboard and attach that to a window in SAP Business One. Of course, uh, we didn't show this in the demonstration, but you can also create your own dashboards unique to your business and attach those to the item master form or the business partner master data. Of course, I can have multiple forms in there too. Let's just quickly demonstrate that. I go back into Earthshaker Corporation, and here I can see when I enable the Analytics tab, I've got gross sales by year, budget by item group, profit margin, and a sales analysis. So again, multiple dashboards included on the side of the Business Partner Master Data Form. Another great example of the use of SAP Business One for HANA giving instant access to information to the users. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the presentation. Please don't forget that there are lots of other videos available on the Leverage Tech YouTube page and lots of blogs available at leveragetech.com.au. Thank you.